Hey, Puddins. I feel like shit. I've been feeling like shit since Sunday. And it's now Wednesday. So, yeah. And ironically, this has just been a really bad week for me. Um, and I just want to let you guys know I probably won't be doing a whole lot of filming. I just wanted to like do like a little vlog today and I think the rest of the week I'm just gonna not because of circumstances but Monday we found out my my grandfather passed away which I call him Papa. And I've been just, you know, besides hurting, because my ear is hurting, and now I think that I've caught some sort of cold, and it's the summertime, um, I'm dealing with the death of that, that which is the death of my papa. We're supposed to bury him Saturday, and... I've been just back and forth crying and haven't really, I haven't, I mean, I stopped, you know what I mean? But it's just been like when I'm alone or when I see a picture of him or I think about him or, or a memory of him pops in my head or a dream or anything like that. It's just so hard to believe he's gone. Um, and it's so ironic he passed away the same day that my memo did, four years later. And I've thought about it a lot, about what I want to do um, to mem memorialize him. And, um, I might end up doing a tattoo of him, just like with my memo. I also want to do my, my other grandfather as well, but, yeah, it's just been really, really hard. And, <clears throat> you know, I'm trying to be, be strong, but... You know, when, you know, a loved one dies that you give a shit about, you really care about them. It's really hard because, you know, and it's just, I mean, I know it'll end up, I mean, he's in a good place. I understand all that. You know, at least he's, you know, he's. Reunited with my memo and blah, 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 blah. I know I understand all that, but to me, it's not fair, you know? It's not fair at all. And I just wish I can get like one more hug or one more kiss or we have over 150 choices but the only one that matters is yours golden corral your choice you're in the match app and now tap on the new misconnection feature there's a cross pass and cheat that this week that is a lot of fun she's cute too yeah how did i miss her you didn't match and i kind of what i kind of think that my papa planned to pass away on my memos anniversary so I'm gonna get up because it's it's been a hard two days past two days because it's hard for me to get up it's hard for me for me to move around it's hard for me to even function because passed away <clears throat> Monday morning, which was the 19th. <coughs> Excuse me. And 
I mean, they say that he died peacefully, which is good. At least he's not suffering no more. In time, I'll probably talk about about it, you know, a little bit further. But I think that I'm probably not going to film for a couple days or maybe even a week or so. Like, I'm going, I mean, maybe I'll film like a favorites video for you or not. I'm not sure yet what it, what the future holds basically with this channel yet. I mean, I, I still want to continue, but I don't know when I'll be back. So I want to do this final vlog until then, just to kind of satisfy you guys and, um, yeah, I just... And if you guys want to comment videos you want me to film when I feel a little bit better to film, um, you can comment, you know, and let me know what you guys want me to do. I, I just wanted to kind of briefly show you, like, what I got for the funeral for me and my kid. Um, so this is my daughter's dress that she's going to be wearing to the funeral it just looks like that with like the little I don't know what kind of skirt bottom part is but I thought that was cute um I think this was like three dollars or something like that not not too much for some reason okay that better I don't know um she got these shoes I don't know where the other shoe went to but they're kind of blingy and, and I you know what I'm saying like I don't know. She picked them out, not me. But with me, <coughs> I don't know if I'm going to be wearing this skirt or not. Um, may or may not. And it's just this really long, like, just straight. It's not really like, it's very lightweight, um, but it's long. It's so long that I'm probably going to end up having to like hike it all the way up to my boobs because it's that long and I didn't even think about considering that I just was like oh I like it and then I got home and I was like oh my god yeah and then I got this because obviously at a funeral you usually tend to wear like neutral clothes like you don't you know you wear like blacks and browns and grays and every now and then maybe you want like in your shirt or like in the skirt you might have a little bit of color but it's not like ba bam color like this you know what I'm saying it's more like you know more just kind of whatever and my wardrobe is usually like either black or pink so whatever but I got this shirt and it's from Calvin Klein I don't know what the skirt and the my daughter's dress was see-through but it's very lightweight because it's gonna be hot I was figuring and the the shirt tails in the back along what does they call this I don't really know I'm not 100% sure um, and I figured I would you know wear that for the funeral and then maybe like afterwards maybe wearing it like open like in the summertime I don't know out maybe maybe so I don't know and like put it like a different shirt different color shirts on but these I was so excited for but I was more excited because I've been wanting some black heels so I can DIY but um I'm gonna wear these to the funeral first and the bottoms look like that they're not red bottoms or whatever but I have this really amazing idea to um, do the bottoms red or pink. I don't know yet. I haven't decided. Um, I was going to clean these up for the funeral. You know what I'm saying? It's a little scuffed. So before I do the DIY, I want to like actually, you know, like sand this part down and then kind of touch it back up with like 
black maybe like black polish or something but the normal Louis Vuittons or Christian Louis Vuitton, Louis Vuitton, Vuitton, not Vuitton, like I'm probably gonna be, I was, somebody told me that one time, they're like, it's Vuitton, not Vuitton, whatever, I don't care. Um, they're a little bit more higher and spikier of a hill and then the point or the shoe part is a little bit more pointier and point is not my thing. So, and also these are a little bit smaller, so I thought maybe I would, obviously. But I'm definitely going to wear these to the funeral because they're just black, you know what I mean? So that's what I got there. I had to get some, like I, I definitely bought um, some inserts to go with it. I just went to the family dollar and got that. I got some cortisone cream for my... Where's that? Oh. So I don't even know where to put it, but I did have to get me some cor cortisone cream for my arm because my arm is got a heat rash on it. And I put a little bit on it before I got home. So that's good. Um I also got some big old band-aids wherever they went to. I don't know. Right here they are. The band-aids. These are the kind that I, I, I actually put this on me and the, I mean, they're freaking huge, but they're like, they're not the kind that's, this is a very shiny band-aid and I totally regret buying them because they're not what I needed. Found it. Okay. So yeah, I got this stuff, cortisone cream. My a lady at work told me about it. So I got some because I never ever have like heat rashes and stuff. I want to try to get it healed before the funeral or not completely healed, but you know what I'm saying? Like, mostly, majority of it. Um, but yeah, we went, we we had a pretty productive day. We went and like, found some stuff for the funeral. And then we, well, we first went to Cold Stone and got some ice cream. Because I'm a fatty and I wanted ice cream. And then, um, yeah, we went to, um... We went to Goodwill and we um, found some stuff there for, you know, funeral wise. Then we ate and then we kind of came back to my mom's house and chilled for a little bit. And that was really just the day that we had, you know what I mean? Like my mom went and got gas, obviously. And um, so, yeah, I, I just want to let you guys know. You know, I'm, I have a beauty con box coming up that's in the mail now. Like it, like I got an email saying it was shipped today. <sighs> if I fill up to it before the funeral, I'll try to pre-record that one, but it probably won't be posted up until I'm feeling a little bit better. Um, let's see. Um, there's not really anything else too much that I'm probably going to do film wise. But I said earlier at the beginning that I was not going to film anything besides the June favorites, but I might end up filming that beauty con box now and then the June favorites when it's here because I don't know. Like, I really don't know. I don't know what the month's going to, like play out for me, you know what I'm saying, since all this shit's happening now, I really don't, so, I mean, guys, thanks for y'all support, and I'm going through a rough little, little time in my, in my day, in my week, month, whatever, year, whatever, <laughs> um, and I'm, I'm thankful for all of you guys that are here and sticking by me even though I'm I know I wouldn't blame you if you were like this bitch is going through a stupid moment you know or not a stupid moment but a down moment um, and I love you guys I really do every single one of you last so grateful for every one of you guys um <clears throat> Without you guys, I probably wouldn't still even be here today. 
on YouTube, obviously, not like here, here, like, you know, as far as like here on this earth, you know what I mean? Because, but, um, I just appreciate you guys. And I'm going through something. And I hope that you guys understand and you guys are still there after. <sighs> after I get through it, you know what I mean? Um, hopefully I can bounce back from it, but it's my papal, so I don't really know if I am or when I am or, you know what I'm saying? I mean, I, I know I will, but like, I just don't know when. So, I love you guys. And, um, well, I guess I could do whether you're dressed up or down, you're beautiful. Love you.